<laughs> like promising, didn't it? I think I scared him. I think I scared that fish. I think he had the plumes. He slurped it under though. It wasn't like he hit it hard. He just kind of took it. Came off. Have you gotten a hit yet? Not even a hit. <laughs> the key is you gotta fish where the fish are, man. You gotta be where the fish are. That tree is not where the fish are. I'm not boat flipping into a kayak. I don't know about you. Thought about it. I just decided it wasn't a good idea. I had to boat flip a speck one time. And he spined me in the leg. That felt nice. I know your buzz bait didn't last but a second. Spook or a Sammy? Huh? Spooks are just real big. Unless you get a little one. The mouse, yeah. His tail tore up. They've all been about that size. I wasn't even looking on that one. That one caught me off guard. Except for one, though. They hadn't been real aggressive. They're... Why do you keep buying them sexy frogs? I'd buy a booyah all day. You figure for the price of two sexy frogs, you can get three booyahs. And I think booyahs are way better. The problem is Walmart only's got that the small ones and the poppers. And they only got that one color. Maybe we'll get one worth weighing today. It ain't gotta be two. We just I just want one. For either one of us. I don't care who gets it. Oh jeez, just splash me, don't you? in the nooks and the crannies, Kev. That fish came on strong. 
He definitely did not suck it under. Yeah, just a little. There he goes. I didn't even get to get him on camera. I'm at four. What are you at, Kevin? Or no, that was five, huh? I'm at five, Kevin. Where are you at? Hey, not bad for the first time ever trying this bait out. The mouse. It's pretty nice. Have you seen one, like in person? Have you felt them? I, I almost want to say they're softer than the actual frogs are. Like, the live target frogs. But the tail feels amazing, dude. That's really the only difference between it and a frog is that tail. I don't know if I can say the durability is great, though. I don't think this uh, rat has very good durability, though. His tail, I think, is about to fall out. Oh, man, I can't skip with the crap of it. Oh, I'm stuck in a tree. That's a good one. Bring your scale. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Holy cow. Calm down. Where's it? Jesus, calm down. Got me all wet. <laughs> don't you jump in my boat there you go I don't know if I'm just hooking up if my hookup ratio is good today or if it's the, the mouse because usually I miss about half of what I <laughs> what hits even though I'm terrible with spinner baits I've been trying to learn them Another good one. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Ow. He's about the same size as the last one. He's longer, but he's not as fat. He's probably about two and a half. Maybe two. I don't know. It's number six, Kevin. Get on the board, Kevin. Oh my god, my casting is terrible today. The mouse is sinking. First miss the day. <laughs> Boy, was it a miss. He messed me up, dude. I ain't seen a, a bite in forever, and then he sucked it under. He might not even really have it. He might have grabbed the tail or something. Might not have been a miss, per se, but we'll call it one. I ain't too mad to admit I made a mistake. There you go. Oh, 
Oh, that was terrible. I missed two, Kev. I've missed two. It started out so good this morning. Hey guys, Frog and Hogs. Um, just a quick talk about the video today. Uh, it's it's gonna serve as not so much a review, but backup footage for that live target field mouse review I did. Uh, if you if you've made it through the whole video, you'll see a lot. The vast majority, probably 90% of the fish I caught um, that day, I caught on the live target field mouse, and I talked about it throughout the video. You know, there's there's some stuff me and Kevin joking around, having a good time, but. Uh, it's definitely going to serve the purpose as a secondary review um, and you you can see a lot better what I was talking about when I was referring to the durability and the 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 mouse sliding up the line or the mouse sliding down the hooks you'll see that better in this video so it's a, it's like an on the water review in addition to a uh, just another a fun fish uh, fun day of fishing for for me um, exciting some some stuff came in the mail for me today um, this is gonna be for my YouTube channel um, this is a external hard drive it'll be able to it, it'll help me keep my my videos longer if I need to uh, go back and find a clip or go back and change something I'll be able to keep all my videos on here and uh, if I ever need to reuse something or or look into something or forget something I'll be able to go back a lot easier I won't have to delete so much I'll be able to store more of my old footage um, other exciting things that came in my wife um, is a self-proclaimed lazy fisherman uh, and she ordered well I ordered for her during Tackle Warehouse's sale the uh, Spro BBZ1 Shad I believe it is yes the Spro BBZ1 Shad in Killer Gill this lure looks amazing and um, I'm sure she'll we'll get we'll get some clips of us on the water and some of the catches she gets with it. She's super excited about it. Um, and I know my, my channel is primarily frog fishing, but I uh, I indulged also during the sale. Got me some some Gans spinner baits. Uh, they look good. They uh they're they're beautiful. This one's the chartreuse color, and uh, I also got a, a a bluegill. And these skirts are hand tied. These these things look phenomenal. I don't know how well you can see them, but um. I just want to thank you all for watching the video and I hope you enjoy it. Um, if you have any suggestions, any any recommendations on what I can do to make this channel better for you guys, please let me know. Please leave a comment. Um, I really want this channel to be something you guys can enjoy. I don't, I don't want it to be just another fishing channel. If there's something I can do to make it better, I want to do it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. and. Um, and uh, thank you. Thank you.